So every student should have their own Chromebook that their parent or, well, their parent or guardian would have signed for. And if you're using your Chromebook correctly, it means you're the only one that's logged into it and you are doing what's asked of you that's school related, that you're not spending your time watching anime YouTube videos or playing Retro Bowl or anything else. The purpose in having the Chromebook is so that you have them for school and for school purposes only. So we put together a, it's a Google Slides and it shows um, a list of a bunch of different sites that are um, more academic in nature than just um, some IO snake game. Um, several teachers came up with the list and so i made this slideshow i put it on the bms student canvas page and it says what can i do when i'm done um and then so it gives a description and a picture of what you might see when you get to that website and the name actually links you to the place so you know exactly where you're going and you're going to the right place not something else so the problem with people playing games and listening to music and anything else is that it's like streaming Netflix. If you're on your computer, then you're taking bandwidth. So if you're on your computer and it's for school purposes, then that's great, it's wonderful. That's why we have them. But if you're done, then you might as well get off your device or you should go somewhere that is, like I said, more academic in nature so that you're not just wasting and using up our bandwidth.